Uh, the flooring doesn't look, it looks to be more tarpish. There is a blue tarp sitting on a chair, like a plastic chair, and it looks to be construction material like paint cans or something in behind it. I'll get you on the other side so you got better lighting. But you're doing a great job. That tree's going to get away for a second. Yep. Alright. I'm not sure what kind of flooring that is, but uh, you can see where this. It looks like a tarp. See how it kind of bubbles up? So it doesn't look like it's a solid flooring. There's a. It like to be a cabinet. And what I would guess to be construction supplies. Obviously, like the rest of the house, not finished. There's a little inner hey, turret thing the, here that I don't know if that's an air the chamber or what, but it looks like there's a window right there. As you come around, you can see the window. 10 4 6 40 0 11 I just went by the airport. 110. 10 4 uh, I'm out west, but... Oop. It sounds like they're going to have a lot of help coming his way, too. But you can see that it's plywood up through there. I don't see anything on the roof that would tell me that that's really an air vent, but... To get around to the other side, opposite side of us, I'll show you the window yet again. But there are no windows. And again, that kind of almost looks like a cabinet or maybe even a door. That might be a door. It is a door. Um, it doesn't look like it's installed. It looks like it goes right next to it there on the left. So it looks like some sort of uh, power tunnel that they could come up through. All right, I'm off. I can't hang on. Okay. All right. But yeah, it appears that that uh, is some sort of... Uh, Oh, like spiral staircase to get up there, and the door is not on it yet, so... That was, uh, looked like to be uh, just a uh, solid core wooden door with a... Uh, what I would describe as just a normal frame that went around it. Nothing spectacular or uh, didn't look metal at all. Uh, definitely the frame was not metal framed, it was wood. But again... Zooming into the roof here real quick, I don't see anything that would indicate that that is anything else but a stairway. I don't see any uh, louvers or anything up top to make me believe it's an air chamber. Uh, you can see all the decks not done on the back side, the windows aren't done. See another vehicle coming down. Pick up truck. A lot of people are walking out now. And the band's uh, still plugging away. Let's see if we can slide in here real quick. I don't think we'll be able to see into that front entryway. It's just way too dark. Taking all the gain off, we can't really get in there very far anyway. But they're all the same people on disc one that we saw running around. There's a camera system right there on the uh, what corner exactly that is. Skip. That's going to be the uh, east. Uh, east, south, east side. Okay. So definitely they have the front door, they'd know you're coming. They have the tents in the wood line. That what in the wood line? All the tents. Yeah. Uh, let's see what other neat little info we need to look up here on this house. Since that uh, wooden panel there is not covered, it's hard to tell whether they just came short or not, but it looks like a window might go in there from that overhang on the eave. So that might be something that they intend to uh, pull out and uh, maybe uh, dispose of in some sort of quick fashion, or they just haven't gotten a, a horizontal window into yet. Funny place for a window, though. Again, security camera up top there on the tower. More people coming in. I'm coming out. Well, you have a headset now? Yes, I do. Okay. And what we're doing is everything's being recorded, but we had to add you two as crew members on here for the preamble, and then uh, it'll go on the next disc.
And as much script as we can give description will help out what we're saying. Possibly. I'm right, back into skid again. I'm going down. There we go. Thank you. All right. I'm trying to keep it pseudo smooth here. Looks like everybody's just hanging out, enjoying the band. Uh, camera's set up all over, of course, for the band. You guys, you, you guys get bored? Sorry? Sorry, what's up? Are you guys getting bored? Oh, no, this is interesting. Yeah, it looks like everybody brought their own band recorder, so uh, I guess they have something to jam out to when they're uh, not in the uh, forever. Family, a lot of family. I want to bring my kid to this. The picnic lunch. Reminds me of a Boston Legal uh, episode. <laughs> oh, man. Ever watch Boston Legal? I don't. I, I don't, but I, I, I mean, I know what it is, but... Let's go into the tree line here on the far side of the house, see a satellite dish. Pine trees. It's all a wooden structure down there, I don't know if it's a clothesline, just what it is. Looks kind of like a clothesline right there. Funny, I don't see the other side of it, so I don't know what it's supposed to be. Uh, maybe it's a... Trying to have clean bridges. Well, I don't know. It's like uh, it looks like it's attached to a big rail system that comes along there. See that right along there. I don't know if it's a water break or whatever, but it seems kind of funny to have a. I guess that's a telephone pole that's laying down behind. All right, continuing on up the side of the property there. I guess we'll call that the uh, east side of the property. Uh, not pulling up too much right now. Not really seen anything. Of course, you got the weekend shanties, I guess, hanging out here. I don't know if that's a new version of a porta potty or whatever. Uh, maybe an outdoor shower. Really. I believe that could be an outdoor, that looks like an outdoor shower right there. Oh, that could be interesting. Sorry about the picture. Alright, let's see. I'm losing it. Out of the, alright. Back in. There's that green hut that everybody keeps talking about. Like everybody's hanging out. Looks like they're all there's some of the tents in the tree lines there, and where the people are sitting in the tree lines. You see the chairs. Of course, taxation is slavery. Gotta love that one. More people hanging out here in the shadows. Uh, seem to be enjoying the band and little barbecue. And again, that's on the east side of the property. Uh, you start to see the cars lined up. We're getting in the trees. So, back on out for a bit. We'll shoot over the west side of the property. Motorcycle. Of course, a nice trailer. Ron Paul for president. That seems, I don't know, maybe he's here. Maybe that's his motorhome. Uh, some guy's sitting on a roof with a camera. He must, he's also uh, enjoying the park festivities. Tractor in the barn. Another Ron Paul for president candidate. Or I should say supporter. I uh, can't get a good license plate on that. 
we're back at the back at the band. You guys cooling off in the back? Who? I'm good. Uh, Matt's good too. Okay. We're all about customer service here. Right. It's, it's comfort service, not custom service. Especially with me. Roger. Okay, back on big house. East side of the property, got a pretty good view of it. Well, oh, I just screwed you on that one. There we go. Coming back up the driveway lines, you can see it looks like air, young and old hanging out. Another tent in the trees. Got some lights along the road there, it looks like. And yeah, just an update on that pursuit that State was involved in. They uh, spiked the vehicle, three, four tire, uh, three tires, that. and uh, came to a stop there on, on Main Street. They uh, got one in custody. He's going to be DUI. All right, let's go in on motor home. Uh, 640, Omaha, 7 Alpha Echo. Camera's not letting me go there. Omaha, 7 Alpha Echo, 640. Yeah, I'm, just to let you know, I'm up. I've been up 10-8 down in uh, Lebanon, so if you get something, uh, officer safety or high speed like that, just let me know. I can, about 20 minutes from the checkpoint, about 30, 25 minutes from Burlington, okay? Thanks, sir. Omaha 7 Alpha Echo 640. Do you want me to run uh, radio checks with you? Or are you headed back this direction? No, I'm up with ATC, so I don't need them right now. Um, if anybody's looking for me, I'm monitoring your frequency, though. Here's that van. That, remember that van from way back when? Had a trailer on it? It's right underneath me. He's stopped under the power line. Where's the judge's place? So he's right in front of the judge's place, he stopped. Uh, I'm trying to find him. He's right at the right. I get, you're tumbled because I, I got you in so close. But that that is that van. You remember the one pulled him with the dark trailer? Yep. You know, quite a few hours ago or last year. Yep. yep, with the he, guy that pulled out the binoculars. Yeah, he's on he, the power line road. He, he, no, he stopped there at the power line, right, right up ahead of the judges. Now he's in the tree line. I can't see him. All right, let me, uh... I don't know if you'll, if you'll get him with the camera or not, but I'm trying to pick him up again. What that guy is doing, I mean, uh, all these guys. Uh, any units, uh, Omaha, how copy? Go ahead, Omaha. Yeah, I don't... Gene was up with us earlier. There's a van that came in with a dark trailer, pulled out a set of binos and was checking us out. Well, that van right now stopped at the power line that runs down in front of the judges, the right-of-way. Once we came over him, he started driving again. He's, uh, but he was stopped there for a while. I was watching him from a distance. Uh, now he's going by the, the, the judge's driveway right now. I'm going to make sure he clears the area, but he was stopped there just to give you a heads up. Okay, copy that. Is it like a teardrop grayish trailer? Yeah, maybe it like, looks almost like a snowmobile trailer. He's on the boot now. A whole bunch of vehicles came in behind him, but he was stopped, uh, like I said, right at that power line right away that you could just come right down and make a left into the, into the judge's place. Yeah, I'm on the road trying to find him. Right now. He's on the move. He went past the, the actual driveway itself. Once we uh, came over to him, he started going. He was stopped there for a few minutes, though. I don't know if he got out or not because of the tree line, but once we, like I said, once we got over him, he is, and right over top of him, his vehicle started moving again. All right, copy that, thanks. Roger. That was kind of weird. Oh, he's kind of weird guy. Yeah, but of all the places to stop. Well, it's hard telling what's in that trailer, though. Yeah, yeah. All yeah, a bunch of cars on the move. 
All coming out the back, or I don't know, is that the back way or the front? I don't know. <laughs> you got me. Joy and them on the ground. I don't know if that's the main way in or not. I'll set it back up on my side to make it easy for you. I just wanted to uh, check something out. Be up the right front about 45. I'm locked on, dude. Oh, okay, you're all good job. Guys, able to keep it to the turn. Cool. That doesn't happen very often, but now you're getting all over that thing now. Uh, righty. Front row parking looks like it's getting ready to move on out. Almost looks like maybe the band's packing up too a little bit. We'll check that on the next side around. But yeah. Everybody's up. Looks like it's at least intermission time, I guess. Roger, daughter. They like to say beer and bud time, maybe? No. Yep. yep, there's the beer. Seeing any illegal stuff going on? No pipes, any bongs or anything cool. To make it even easier to go in. What do we got here? I'm trying to see what this guy's got behind. He's got something over his shoulder. See it right there? Yeah, put my visor. I can't tell. That almost looks like a gun right there. It, it could be. Could be a camera. Could be a gun. I can't like, get it. Oh, that's a, that looks like, yeah. looks like a pistol. Okay, I thought it was a long gun. So I was gonna have it. A little bit out of focus, but... There you go. You had it. Oh, it's a pistol. Yeah. Yeah, from Omaha, I'll copy. Go ahead, Omaha. I got back to let you know they're exercising their right to bear arms, okay? Okay, they got the long arms visible? Now, uh, got a pistol in a holster uh, strapped to one of the guys down here. There he is. Let's see if I can get... Okay, does he have a black uh, ball cap on? Uh, not this time. Uh, negative on the ball cap. He had his hand resting back on it, like, trying to show his... Looks like maybe a couple clips on the left there. He's got something in his hand. Maybe he did have a black ball cap. We saw he had a uh, baseball cap on, and you could tell he was carrying. Um, that's a good copy. Yeah, he is next to the, the hand with the uh, baseball cap. Seven years. Uh, seven years of vehicles there, you think? No, I think it's, uh, we lost probably 10 vehicles. The driveway isn't bumper to bumper any longer. And one or two of the vehicles that were down in the semicircle are gone. But, uh, the bumpers, the, the driveway all the way out is still packed, but there's a few spots that can park in there. Alright, looks like he was checking us out. Bruce of a man. Yep. Not a little man. Charlie 26, 22. Those IRS agents are good shots too, man. It's a good thing. You good at boot shooting on the booth with that thing? You haven't looked at it. Matt, are you, in a, are you enjoying good at shooting on the booth? Guess we'll find out. <laughs> oh. 
hope not. <laughs> Alright, zooming back out. Anyway, that was your cat with the gun. It should say a cat with a gun. We're trying to hop where we can't see. Try unloaded a whole bunch of stuff today. Oh, I'm sure. I mean, it almost looks like that guy's strapped coming out the driveway. Yeah, there's small groups of three and four as you come out the driveway that are congregated, you know, all the way out towards the end. Like the band's still going? You're right. You can congregate at the end of the by the road. Well, it's uh, north of the road, but there are just small groups of three and four. Sierra 12, 640. He'll be 26 with Pennsylvania truck, Yankee Kilo Alpha. Three hey, we got, if you got a chance to look up there, you're still doing what you're doing. I'm going to try to see if this guy's this group of guys. It almost looks like a, it's hard to tell if they had a car. I don't know, maybe Joey can check it out to bind us. All right, what do you want to do? Coming out the driveway, there's a group of three or four up here off my right front, 45 degrees. And uh, I don't know if they're, I was just going to see if they're strapping or not. They're in a clearing. There's a red car, and you just come north of it, you know, towards the aircraft, right behind the van. White van? Uh, no, it's a, it's a red van or pickup. And they're right off the, the nose of a silver car facing our way. Let's see. Now, uh, come up the driveway more, up towards the nose of the aircraft. You always got the binoculars, just trying to... Okay. Keep going up the driveway. Right there. They're waving. Uh, I think they're just... Oh, uh, wait, what's that one? Behind the tree there. Little hippies. Okay. Drinking beer, wanting to know why we're bothering them. I'll come around a little bit so we get a... I don't see, I only see three there. Okay. Those three in the open. Yeah, smile. You can do the zig hile, dude. It's all right. You're you don't look too happy, that one. The blonde. She's waving. <laughs> she did not look happy. All right. Lost them in the tree. Yeah, I came around the trees. I, I don't want to sit there and hover because of the... No, oh, it's cool. The weight, power to weight ratio. Jiggy with it. I don't look good falling anyway. I wouldn't fall, but it'd get real shaky and I'd have to fly out of it, so... I figured I'd just fly out of it before it did. Alright. We're right around here. Yep. Somewhere... 640, Sierra 12, 10-8. 10-4, Sierra 12. Oh. You're good. You're right, Mark. There you go. There we go. I right, want this specimen coming back to a lot better. Tighten that thing up. Feels good. Joy, uh, Joy just got sick. Oh, uh, okay. That's okay. I'm gonna take you back. I right, go ahead and uh, hit stop on this. Yeah.